me was when it first got here. I said, what's better up here? Mm. <coughs> when he's going back to uh, England, he hits the airport and they immediately stamp him legal and allows him to fly out. No questions asked. So, uh, Dex was a very, very young, clever futures trader. I mean, it's, it's obvious if you're in the futures, and he decides to give it up, and that's his story. Then uh, he's coming out. He's almost blackmailing the MI6 to stop him. Mm. They've come out to prove it. So I think we did. <laughs> <laughs> So uh, he came out the uh, moment my brother died. So uh, that's drawing a pretty thin line. Mm. Because I always thought I could get my brother to tell the truth. Just one. No way out. Unless he did something he did, but no, I didn't hear about it. But Dick shows up. <coughs> and the uh, miracles just start pouring out from that to the point where he was uh, seasick for three days. <laughs> yeah, that's right. <laughs> so is that mass delusion or, or did he come up with it? I didn't say that, right? Mm. He fulfilled the prophecy. So suddenly he saw himself being an MI6 agent in the position of uh, himself being the actual reason he is the agent to get him here to become acquainted with God. And what the MI6 and death threats meant were nothing. He's just going to tell the truth, which he did on the radio, talking to, uh, what's it, uh, Donnie? Donnie, yeah. So Donnie gets shut down as soon as he admits that he had a dream where it said I was right. Yeah, that's right. Next time he's, next, he's shut down, right? Mm. Then the trolls come in and they start copying his, his website as if it's him. So it's pretty bloody obvious, isn't it? Seconds I had him admitting he was a spy sent out by the FBI. He worked for Obama. He uh, was a male in the mail room mm -hmm. that sorted Obama's mail. Right. And um, <clears throat> foolishly, 